So, a bit of an update. I was worried that that seal might uh, have been damaged and started to leak, but it looks like it's okay. Um, I took those damaged bits off. And that is the melted pivot point here. Okay. This one, which would sit like that and it would have a plastic cap that of course just melted and then this spring which I'm assuming has gotten so hot it's no longer a spring it's just a paper clip right now anyway I was able to find one at the uh, local Audi dealer I've got the pivot point here I've got a new clip and then one of these I have it ordered for Thursday I also order one for Wednesday online Whichever comes first, that's the one I'll use. Uh, in the meantime, I will continue my cleaning here. There's what's uh, left of the flywheel. The uh, pressure plate. Of course, the clutch. The uh, throwout bearing and the sleeve. The old slave cylinder is popped. Uh, there's the rod for it, there's the uh, remaining in here in that glove because it's been leaking, dripping in my head, so I'll have to pull the uh, flex plate and replace the pilot bushing, which is over there, with those needle bearings. Um, clean up a little bit here, because it flung brake cleaner all over the catalytic converter through the starter hole um, yeah pretty cool job uh, let's see the new parts I've decided to switch from a Luke or Luck self adjusting clutch that basically has these springs in it um, and uh, when these things fail, these side doohickeys, these, these plates, um, they, uh, th those blades will, will get pushed to the edge and the centrifugal mass will spin it so hard it, it actually turns into a saw blade. And uh, it ends up cutting the bell housing all the way around like Swiss cheese. I, it Honestly, it just cuts it right in half. So uh, in order to avoid that, I am moving away from this luck or Luke or whatever you want to call it, clutch and flywheel. This flywheel is just completely garbage. Um... Look how hot it got. It's it's changed color. I will uh, I will inspect the rear main seal when I take the flex plate off. Uh, here's a new one. Quite a different color. Here's a new clutch. It's got a. This is the gearbox side, obviously this is the flywheel side, so that'll stay like that. And then see the difference in the pressure plate. Uh, in my opinion, less moving parts, less springs, susceptible to heat, uh, less stuff to go bad. So this will go like that, and then on top of it. We'll have one of those throw out bearings like that with the metal race that'll ride in there all through a new uh, guide sleeve that'll be attached to the transmission. I'm gonna clean that up really well, make sure it is straight. Should be able to reuse it because it's really, really thick. These don't really, it's still straight. 
they don't really go bad when they do get hot um, so this will clean up just fine uh, here's the uh, replacement slave cylinder this is actually a metal unit no more plastic because plastic sucks and it breaks and ruins your clutch so yeah but now I have to wait for this tiny little piece before I can put this whole thing back together which sucks because I have everything else but this oh well there